floods and surface area. Huh. Let's see. Start off with this one. We kind of want to think, and you have to be careful here so oh, we yeah. don't miss anything. Um, I like to start off with the easiest ones. Okay. I recognize right away that I have right here a rectangle. Oh, nice. And do I have any other rectangles that are similar in dimensions? Yeah, we do. I think both those two rectangles, the one on the left-hand side. Right here. Yep. And the one in the back. And there is one in the very back. So I have three rectangles that are the same. How do we know they're the same? Let's look at the base and the height. Base is 8. Uh-huh. Height is 10. Okay, and how about the back side, though? How do we know that's 8? Oh, on the very top of this triangle here. Base uh, is 8. 8. Ten. All right. And the so back side, here's your 8. eight. Okay. So and it's an ten. equilateral triangle there. Okay, cool. All right, sorry. Okay. So we have three of those. Then let's just go ahead and think about all the shapes that we have. After that, we have, let's go to the top. We have a triangle here. Mm -hmm. so pick a different color. Ooh. Triangle. Any other triangles that have the similar dimensions? Yeah, I think all the ones on the very top. Yeah, because they all have a base of 8, as we talked before. Right. And mm -hmm. they have a height of 7. seven. So plus 3 triangles in the red. And we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. The last one left. All right, we have one in the very bottom that's sitting on right now. And that's also a triangle. It here. is. So if we keep these all helpful coordinated, maybe we can... But I think there's one triangle in the bottom. Oh, what am I doing? One. Friday afternoon. Yeah, one. All right. Okay. So let's just go ahead and crank this all up. So three times the rectangle. Area of the rectangle is? Base times height, so which is 8 ten. times 10. Okay. Plus? Three areas of the triangles up top. Well, one of those areas of the triangles is half a bit half. The base is 8 times the height, which we know is 7. All right. And the last one we have left? Is the base, which is half the base of 8 times the height is given us is 6.9 inches. All right. So yeah. I guess the th one thing we have to be careful of is to recognize the fact that the green triangles and the red triangles are different. Yeah. And we can't just say four triangles. as right. We have to make sure we keep track of what's the same, what's different. Yep. All right. So we go ahead and probably grab our calculator here. Okay. So three times well, 30 times A, that's 240. Nice. Plus, maybe well, we should calculate that one out. Do you have a. Uh, well, here? we can four. cancel the 4, 28, or yeah, 28 times 3. Oh, that's too hard to do. 28 times 3. 84. 84. This becomes 4. Mm -hmm. mm, 54 times 4. Is that right? Uh, 6.9 times 4. Oh, gosh. I thought that was 6. I thought that was <laughs> 6 times 9. Oh, man. 6. <laughs> it is a problem. Oh, gosh. Times 4. Plus 27.6. And we add them all up. This takes a little while. We it have does. a calculator here. Plus. About 240. 351.6. And units is inches squared. squared. Nice. Nice. All right. Let's. There's that one. Let's 